Good afternoon, students. Today we're gonna talk about uh, a new lesson that we explained a lot before, apostrophes. This is what, this is the sign of what, of apostrophe. We use apostrophes to show where a number or letter has been left out. To make nouns and some pronouns possessive or to form what, certain plurals. Look here, I'll go a little bit back. We said we use what? We use apostrophes. This is an apostrophe to show where a number or letter has been left out. For example, look here. If I said I am, if I wanted to make it short, it'll be this way I am. I put apostrophe in place of what? Of the letter what? The letter A. So to show where a number or letter has been left. To make some nouns or nouns and some pronouns possessive, for example, if I said Ali's, Ali's car, Ali is a singular noun. If I wanted to make position for a singular noun, I'm going to add what? I'm going to add apostrophe S. means what? The car of Ali. Also, we have, guys, do you remember possessive pronouns like uh, uh, his car? This is a possessive adjective, guys. Do you remember the possessive adjectives and the, the possessive pronouns that are not followed by what? That are not followed by by nouns. Like for example, uh, this is my pen. It's mine. This is my pen. It's mine. Mine here is a possessive what? A possessive pronoun that is not followed by followed by a noun. Also, we use what, guys? We use uh, apostrophe. Okay, or apostrophe and S to form what? To form certain plural. For example, if you have a letter and you wanted to make it plural like this, I wrote many what? Many A's today on the paper. Look here, guys. I wanted to make the letter A uh, a little bit plural and instead of writing a and s it will be a mistake grammatical mistake i put what guys apostrophe apostrophe s so we can make some letters plural or to form what certain plurals by adding what by adding apostrophe apostrophe s if i said i wrote many souls many ends the word end if i wanted to make it plural i'm not gonna add s to end it will be a mistake. If I wanted to make it plural, I'm going to add what? Apostrophe. Apostrophe. Yes. I think it's clear. Now let's go, guys, to complete our lesson. Okay. Use, guys, use an apostrophe to form a contraction. Like this. It is. It will be it's. A shortened form of what? Have a word, a numeral. If you have a number like 2009, 2009, look here, I make it what, guys? I make it this way. Cannot, it'll be what? It'll be can. The apostrophe shows where letters or numerals have been left out. Here I put apostrophe instead of what? Instead of 20. Here I put instead of I, I put here instead of O, guys. I think it's clear. Let's talk about what, guys? Let's talk, let's talk about the rules of using apostrophe. Now, let's go, guys. Now, guys, we're going to talk about the rules of what? Of using uh, apostrophes. Use an apostrophe to make nouns and the pronouns. Show position. If you have a singular noun and you wanted to make position for it, you add what, guys? Add an apostrophe s. For example, the story is ending. Here we have a singular noun and I wanted to make position for it. I added what? Apostrophe s. It means what? The ending of, of the story. Great aunt's name. Here we have also a singular noun and I wanted to make what? Position for it. I added apostrophe s. The name of the great aunt's. Now let's go, guys. If you have a plural noun that is ending in S, 
you know guys if, if I wanted to make a noun plural I put s or es this is the regular what the regular rule if it is irregular you keep it you don't add s or es you keep it guys you memorize it by heart so if you have a noun a plural noun ending in s and you wanted to make position for it you add one apostrophe for example cities streets the streets of the cities the parents cars the cars of uh, parents I think it's clear look guys if you have a noun a plural noun that is not ending in s what are you going to do you deal with it as what the same way as what as you dealt with the singular noun you deal with it okay you add what you add apostrophe and add what apostrophe huh plural noun that is huh? do not end in what do not end in s add an apostrophe and what guys and and s uh, and, uh, apostrophe and s i think it's a clear like for example men's what men's sweaters men's what men's sweaters people's what people's choice means the sweaters mean the sweaters of men people's the choice the choice of the choice of people the choice of what guys people i think you have here a plural noun that do not end in s so i put apostrophe and what apostrophe and, and s now let's complete if you have what guys if you have more than one noun and you want to make position for what are you going to do? You add apostrophe s to the last noun. To the last what? To the last noun. Laura and and Alice in the art project. Here we have what? So many nouns and we wanted to make position for them. So I'm not gonna add apostrophe s to each one of them. No, no. I'm adding apostrophe s to the last what? To the last to the last noun. If you have indefinite pronoun, what is an indefinite pronoun, guys? A pronoun that is not referring to a specific person, a place, or thing, or idea. Like somebody, like anyone. It's not referring to one person definitely. Okay, if I wanted to make position for that, I'm going to add what? Apostrophe what? Apostrophe S. Somebody's code. The code of somebody. Anyone's guess. The guess of anyone. So if you wanted to make position to an indefinite pronoun that can show... If you wanted what to make position for an indefinite pronoun to show position guys you add what you add apostrophe apostrophe s add an apostrophe and what and s look guys here use an apostrophe and s to form the plurals of letters words numbers and some symbols in general however do not use apostrophes to form the plurals of what of nouns for example the word uh, letter B, if I wanted to make it plural, it will be B apostrophe S. I wrote several B's today. And instead of putting the B and S, it will be a great mistake, guys. He said many souls. I put what apostrophe S. If I put S directly, S-O-S, it's an abbreviation. It's an acronym, I think, for what save our souls. So if I wanted to make soul plural, I'm going to add what apostrophe S. Two fours. I like to make four plural. If I put S, it will be a great mistake. So I put apostrophe S. Also, you have what? We have uh, uh, some symbols and what? And some numbers. You can add what? Apostrophe S if you wanted to make it plural. Now, remember. Do not use an apostrophe in the possessive forms of personal pronouns. If you have what? For example, a possessive pronoun like theirs. Don't put apostrophe s to make position because it's a possessive a possessive pronoun in itself it's a possessive what a possessive pronoun how can you add a apostrophe s to a possessive what to a possessive pronoun the book is theirs so the book is it's a mistake incorrect it will be the book is theirs do not confuse it with it it apostrophe s is an huh, is short for what guys it is but it's 
is what is the possessive form of of it. It's my cat that injured its paws. It's my cat. It is my cat. It is my cat that injured its what its paws. It's here is a possessive what a possessive form of the pronoun it. Okay. Thank you guys for today's lesson. Hoping to find it in Jaipur. If there is any problem, you can contact me on my email or you can call me on my mobile phone. Your assignment will be page 284. And I'm going to share the answer key for you guys today, inshallah.